Never really thought about it, but I think I can cook my cans in whatever the hell one of these bonfire type things. This is pretty cool. There we go, there's our code lock. That's awesome. Okay, so with this new building 3.0 stuff, I should, yes, be able to build the fucking greatest little tiered stacked base here. This is going to be dope. Look at this. This is what I wanted to do. This is what we've come on for, for, for guys. This new, uh, if you didn't know, Rust has a new building system. Building 3.0, which apparently changes the way that Rust will be played forever. I, I, I don't know about that. I'm going to need a doorway here. I think. Yeah. You get these new weird, like, half walls? No, what I needed to do... Place, then. Probably don't have the resources for this base. No. Well, this was foolish of me, wasn't it? Alright, now you're probably thinking, Sills, why have you built your base like this? And that's a completely and perfectly fine question, because I don't really know. If I <laughs> destroy that, I can then make that wood instead, and I can always just chop that out, right? And then it can become a door. Probably should have done it as that one. Balls. Oh, sugar, that is cool. Look at that new furnace design. Oh! Mm, I like that. Well done. Alrighty, we need to go and grab ourselves some components. How is everybody doing today? How, I hope we're all having a really good day. This is a fresh wipe, um, force wipe. I'm a couple of days late um, on the force wipe, so I've had to choose a random server that wiped a couple of days late. It's Saturday night right now. Um, it is the middle of the night, so it is going to be quiet. As I want to try and get my base down. This is a, a normally a high pop server. I've played it before, so I want to try and get a base down now before it all gets kicking off tomorrow. Hopefully, that's the plan. Um, so we're just going to try and hit up some components and shit. We need to sort of see how many bases are about. I have seen one or two um, really close to me. I need to just sort of breast this hill over here, and then we really will start to see some. Uh, Hopefully some action. We live nice and close to a gas station, I think that is, and really close to the harbour as well, so really, really good links for uh, recyclers and stuff, which is really good. And then obviously we live right on this road, which is awesome. Okay, well I was just about to craft a couple of furnaces, right? A couple extra furnaces, should I say, because I didn't think these were going to be enough, blah, blah, blah. I haven't actually got any metal ore. Things aren't going great. And then I took a quick look. I'm already starting to fucking decay. <laughs> That's mental! Look at that! That's the new building update. How are you guys finding it? This decay is crazy. They're obviously going to sort it out and things. Um, they're going to like nerf it or whatever. But that is mental. Like I've got to waste all of that stone there. And some wood actually. So that I can keep my base from decaying for the next 24 hours. And I've got to have to repair this that has decayed. And the walls decay now. That's crazy. What do you guys think to that? I definitely think that should be nerfed a little bit. That is actually pretty crazy. Not a fan of that. Like, I'm a fan of it, because it's going to make raiding so much cooler. Like, I bet we can go around and find maybe some decay, half-decayed bases and things. But at the same time, fuck, my base is going to get shat on. So with this new decay, that should mean that bases like this... Yeah, I'll take that. Alright. Thanks, bud. I'm starting to decay, or can I not see the decay? Why can't I see the decay on it? What's that about? Anybody? Is that just my game fucking up? I can't, I can't see the health. Do I need a hammer? Oh, yes, yeah, so I can see the health now. Okay, so you need a hammer to see health. That's good to know. And it's all on 100. 500. Okay. So I wonder if that guy was that guy. The guy we just killed was the guy who lives there. Probably, probably. Also, guys, if you haven't noticed, have you? Oh, well, have you noticed a change in how my game looks? Because I finally got round to buying a 1080 graphics card. So I've upgraded from a 1060 with 1080 now, which is pretty, for me, is a pretty big jump in terms of viewing pleasure. I'm getting over 100 frames constant, consistently right now, and I'm freaking loving it. It's incredible. I'm loving it. So I, I, I just want to say while we're here, thank you to you guys that support me on streams and things, because you guys are the reason that I could buy this graphics card, which means the streams aren't laggy anymore, which means the game looks beautiful like it does, and just means that the whole YouTube experience for you and me is going to be so much better. So thank you to you guys, and yeah, fuck. Let's just get into this episode, right? Like, let's just go and loot. Let's just go do it. Alright, that is enough farming done, realistically. I mean, I'm not 
pumping loads of time into farming here. It's kind of pointless, so I'm just going to sort of save my stone and my resources in here. Um, I guess I could make another furnace. Is that worthwhile? We've got no frags. Why is this noise when you go into things? I'm not a fan of that. Not a fan of that one flipping bit. Just need to make sure this isn't getting looted every few seconds. And we'll be good. Let's... Thanks, buddy. There's the wood armor I needed. And another salvaged axe. Alright. Scintillating stuff, guys. Just gonna run this stuff home right real quick. Uh, I mean, that's 50 scrap. Actually, let's recycle these bits and bobs. Pretty happy with that. Well done. Yeah, it's gonna give us a load of frags, actually. We're actually on course as well to get in the workbench that we need. Oh, I see a guy. Alrighty. He has a t-shirt on? He did. Ooh. Nothing great, but always take a spare bow at this stage of the white. I like these new roads as well. They're really sexy, actually. Really nice. All right, let's make a couple of very quick alterations to this base. Well, alterations, expansions. I need a little bit of extra room, and I seem to have fudged the build. I won't lie to you guys. Okay, so now. We've got like this outer bit, which is really f fucking curmudgeon-y. Um, but it gives us a little bit of extra room for activity. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to knock that wall through now. Um, with the salvaged axes, I think I've got f I think I've got three of them. Two. I'm sure I've got three. Yeah, I've got three of them. So I, I, it should not take too long, hopefully. And then we've got plenty more room. Grab a bit of that. Bit of that. And we can jump through and this will be like a... Uh, I don't know what this will be yet, but it's going to be summon. Fuck! I didn't even see this guy. I didn't even see him coming, you know. That's my, my fuck up, but didn't see him coming at all. Obviously I'm going to run out and try and kill him, oh my god. I'll see you, baby. Shaking that ass out. This guy's a god. Get better tools. There's a big boy base here. I wonder if this is the sort of direction he was running. It's got a key on it. It's on a wood foundation at the back here. Oh shit, it's low. <gasps> That's two health? This is decayed, guys. This is literally decayed. Over the course of the day, I think. Oh shit, it's like a little mini clan base? And there's bugger all in it. But like a little mini little mini clan base. That's that's really weird. Oh no. I thought you could jump on these. Oh wait, I've got the key to get out. You fucking melt. Bloody door's low. Does the door decay? No, it's the foundation. Okay. So there's our first little experience of, I guess, do you call that raiding? Raiding with the new system. Kind of weird. That must have decayed so fast, man. I've heard stories of people coming back to their bases after a couple of hours and their base just being gone. It's really funny. We need to make sure that we load up our base with probably like two or three K stone. Just to, look, there's another one straight ahead of us. Looks like it's all decayed apart from the... I swear I heard somebody then. Looks like it's all decayed apart from the stone foundations. Look at this. I bet these are low. These aren't even that low. Alright, I'll take it. Beggars cannot be choosers right now. Alright, let's be going night time again, which is just all rust is these days. So what I'm going to do is stock these bits and bobs inside. We've got 1500 stone. I think that's enough to do 24 hours of base protection. I think, and I've got some spare metal ore I can cook. It's it's getting pretty crazy, in fact, how much I'm going to need. Like, I need 1,072, your base is not protected and is decaying. Oh, what about now? 
Well, we don't know. Okay. Um, I need to put some... Oh, I need to put some metal frags in. Oh, okay, I get it. It's decaying on metal frags. Yeah, we go. So it's protected for one day, 20 hours, 12 minutes right now. So I can leave it pretty long. All right, okay, that's... What about that? Yeah, all right. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. Hey, anyway, guys, just before... Before I forget, I'm going to ask, I um, think, obviously I do like to upload some other content than Rust. I know you guys don't have to watch it, it'd be great if you did, but I understand you don't. I've uploaded some PUBG um, before, but I'm thinking about like, buying and uploading some Star Wars Battlefront 2 or a box. What do you guys think to that? Are you, are you down for that? I mean, it's I want to buy it for myself, but it's like a 50, 60 odd pound game, which is a lot of English money, so it would be more beneficial to me if you guys were interested in seeing some videos on it. If you are, please, please, please do let me know in the comments because I'd love to buy it and upload it for you guys. Ooh, a new hatchet. Now that, that is good, a metal hatchet. Fuck, I'm tempted not to risk this, but we're here. We're not queer. Oh, another one. Oh, well, alrighty then. Ooh, no, no, no. Someone dropped some pants and someone else. This isn't good. An acoustic guitar, a baseball cap, a crossy, and a wooden arrow. Well, I'm taking that. Alrighty. That is awesome. We are home. Right, there's only two doors to our like, loot, but uh, I like to think we're not going to get raided. I don't really know. First thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to throw that into there. Throw my scrap in and begin research, because if we can get a hatchet, that is a really nice result from that run. Um, we also got a load of bits and bobs, and I'm, I'm happy, I'm happy. That rad suit's going to be huge for us this wipe. Alright, dead quick, let's just learn that blueprint. Really good. Actually going to store my scrap, because you guys always tell me just store the strap in here, so... Let's drop it in there, and we're, we're Gucci, we're good, we're good. Um, all resources, just store in there for the bants. And I think, guys, that is where we are going to end today's episode. I think we've been reasonably productive. Nothing. I always like to finish on, like, a, I don't know, something big, like a big, a big event. But I think we've done, we've done pretty good. I'm pretty happy with our wipe. We've got a really nice base. We've tried out the new system. We know how fucking difficult it's going to be. We are safe for two days and 52 minutes, which is awesome. I'm going to come back on tomorrow anyway, if not later. So, yeah. I'm really happy. I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. If you did, please drop a like. It means the world to me. It really helps the channel out, gets the video out there. It's it's awesome. Um, join my Discord if you aren't in it already. Drop me a comment. Let me know what you thought of the episode. Subscribe if you're new. Most of all, have an incredible day. And yeah, I'm really excited for this wipe. Let's kick on. Hit the like if you are. And yeah, catch you in the next one.